They were working on a 1976 Massey Ferguson 275 farm tractor. has the Perkins diesel in it. Uh, concern is the power steering is making a mess here with hydraulic fluid. On some tractors, there is a seal, which is why we had this steering wheel off first, thinking that the seal would be bad. On this tractor here, though, it's a uh, dry column. So the problem's actually coming from the seal on the orbital uh, itself, which I'll show you in a minute here. Um, one thing I want to note while I'm up here on the tractor, to get at the bolts that hold the orbital in, you're going to want to come in through here with a long extension. I'll show you that in a few minutes. There's four bolts. You'll take that off there. Go around to where the orbital's normally mounted. Orbital's usually mounted. You can see the bottom of the steering shaft coming through the column there. Again, that's a dry column. There shouldn't be any fluid there. Then you have four hydraulic lines here coming from the uh, power steering pump and going to the ram. What you're going to need to get these lines off is, a, I believe it was an 11 16th crow's foot. That's obviously not the 11 16th. Here it is. It's still on the extension. 11 16th crow's foot. And you might need another 11 16th wrench to hold the fitting from spinning on it. So as you guys can see here, this is where the steering shaft comes in the center of this. Try to get my flashlight positioned up here. There we go. So this was filled with oil when I took it off. There definitely shouldn't be any oil there. Or it's actually leaking around this o-ring right here so I got an orbital seal kit from I think it was yesterday's tractor I'll get the part numbers for the next video take this inside of the workbench get it apart and show you guys what's going on there all right thanks for tuning in